God is healing your wounds and restoring your finances. God is guiding you into your best season ever. Be encouraged. Like this video if you are blessed. God is saying to you today, You have suffered privately, but I am about to reward you publicly. The Lord is so good. He is working on things you don't even know about yet. He is orchestrating solutions that will blow your mind. Do not be worried or distracted. He is for you and God won't fail you now. Stay strong. Something good is coming your way. I don't know who needs to see this, but Isaiah 60:22 says, When the time is right, I, the Lord, will make it happen. Don't worry. God has you in the palm of his hand. Trust his timing. Repeat after me. I will not let anyone or anything take me back to a place that I prayed my way out of. God is saying to you today, Trust me. I've stayed with you through every storm in your life. I've given you all that you need. I have and always will protect you, your family, and your loved ones. Things may be difficult for you right now, but just trust in my timing. A change in your circumstances is coming. I love you. Be encouraged. Donate to our ministry if you are able. God is saying to you today, victory is coming to your household. Victory is coming in your finances. Victory is coming in your health. You are healthy and blessed. You are prosperous, successful, and loved. You are growing and you are winning. Expect good news today. Expect new opportunities today. Expect healing today. Expect breakthroughs today. I declare God is making a way for you right now. God is turning your bad report into a praise report. A major shift is happening. God is saying to you today, the biggest breakthrough and blessing of your life is about to manifest. Don't give up. Keep moving forward. This is the confirmation you've been praying for. You asked for a sign. This is it. God heard your prayer. Something big is coming. The struggle is over. God is pouring blessings and miracles over every area of your life. You are coming out of this. A prayer for today. Dear God, make me better. Change my attitude. Change my approach, change my mind, change my reactions. In Jesus' name, amen. God is going to take you to a place where you'll be so busy catching blessings, you'll have no time for stress. God is saying to you today, three mountains are being removed from your life, debt, sickness, and disappointment. Comment amen if you love Jesus. This month you will experience consecutive wins, healing, unexpected blessings, financial freedom, and spiritual growth. I declare nothing about your life will remain the same. You will receive everything you've been waiting and praying for. In Jesus' name, amen. God is your doorkeeper. God controls what opens and what closes. I believe this month you're going to see some doors open that have been closed for a long time. Suddenly your health will improve. Suddenly you will meet the right person. Suddenly your career will take off. What happened? The doorkeeper stepped in. Get ready for some open doors this month. God is saying to you today, you're entering a new season where everything will start to go your way. It's time. You had enough lessons. You did the work. You overcame so much. You believed in me even when it was hard to. You never gave up. You pushed and prayed through it all. Now it's your time to receive my favor and my blessings in a major way. Your life is about to take a positive turn. 
Subscribe if you trust in God's plan. This month, God is going to bring you endless blessings, bigger smiles, financial breakthroughs, and bigger opportunities. God is saying to you today, you need to get ready. Where you are is not permanent. Blessings and breakthroughs are coming your way. I will increase you beyond your salary. I will bless you beyond your normal income. I will suddenly change things in your life. You are going to make it. That situation that is suffocating you is coming to an end. God's got you, and he has already made a way of escape for you. God is saying to you today, you are healing. You are growing. Doors are opening. Blessings are manifesting. Miracles are coming your way. You're about to receive some good news. God is fixing your situation. God is saying to you today, I am sending my angels to assist you. Expect a sudden positive change in your life. Blessings will not pass you by. God is saying to you today, Victory is coming, healing is coming, financial freedom is coming, and new levels are coming. Keep going. You are on the right track. Share this post if you believe in miracles. God is going to give you a miracle for that situation you thought was impossible. God's hand is on you. He has already fixed it. He has worked that situation out. Now you're about to see what God has been up to all along. Declare by faith, it's already done. God is turning your private prayers into public miracles. God is saying to you today, I am going to take every bit of anxiety, fear, stress, and pain away from you and fill you with my peace, love, healing, and blessings. God is saying to someone today, I won't leave you, no matter what people do. God wants you to know that his presence surrounds you today. You are not alone in this. The next thing God does for you and your family will be big, miraculous, and mind-blowing. Healing, blessings, breakthroughs, and favor are headed to your house. Claim it and receive it by faith. God is saying to you today, You may be tired, discouraged, and frustrated, but don't give up. I'm about to open doors for you. Your situation is about to change. Today is a turning point for you. God is propelling you forward into new territory, new blessings, new relationships, new assignments, and new opportunities. You are not stuck or held back. God just turned that stressful situation around. You are about to soar to new heights. Send this to someone who needs encouragement. God is about to drop a blessing on you that will shock your enemies. Keep praying and keep moving forward. The ones who celebrated your pain, gossiped about your past, and plotted your downfall shall also be the ones to see the public favor and blessings coming your way this year. Mark it down and remember this word. God is saying to you today, your days of mourning are over. I am restoring your joy and finances. This week, God is going to set in motion a chain reaction of abundance and prosperity. You will be amazed at how everything turns out. You will be attracting love, healing, job opportunities, new streams of financial income and blessings. Do not cast your thoughts forward worrying about the future. Rest in the present where I am speaking to your heart. Tomorrow will be here before you know it. But today is where I want to teach you new things. I want to talk to you about the trial you are going through 
and help you to understand how keeping your faith in me while going through challenges is drawing you closer to my heart. It is in these times that I am molding you into my image and likeness and perfecting your heart. Follow us for daily blessings, sweet friend, beloved of my heart. Do not worry about what is going to happen today. Put all your faith and trust in me. That is the very best thing you can do, the only solution that will truly make a difference in the outcome of your day. No matter what you are facing, we can tackle it together. You will be successful as you lean on me with all your heart. Remember, my yoke is easy and my burden is light. I will not give you more than you can handle. I will always be your strength as you call upon my name. Not one tear shed goes unnoticed by me. And those times when you are so in pain that you don't even have the energy to shed a tear, I know what you are feeling and going through. I have you in the palm of my hand. You are more than a survivor. You are a conqueror. Great is the hand of the Almighty upon your life. Take my hand and walk with me. I have something special to show you this day. You may feel at times that I have not followed through on my promises. I have. There is a time and season for all things. When it is the right time, my perfect time, you will see my light. I will reveal to you my purpose and perfect will. Comment hallelujah if you are thankful. Do not lose heart. Keep your eyes fixed on me and in time you will receive your reward. My blessings and peace are ever before you. Just continue to press in and keep your eyes and heart focused on me and my presence. Rest in me today and it will be well with your soul. Even if you feel as if you are alone in this battle, remember this truth. I will never leave you nor forsake you. My truth will send the enemy to flight and set you free. The enemy has no power to stand up against the truth, and as you proclaim the truth, there is nothing more he can do but flee. This battle has already been won. God is saying to you today, they said you wouldn't make it. They said you didn't deserve it. They tried to stop you from receiving my best. My child, know that promotions and blessings come from me. What I promised you, no one can take, block, or destroy. Stay in faith. I am about to overwhelm you with blessings. Post God is good if you agree. God is saying to you today, I am sending great change into your life. I have heard your prayers. I know your heart and I know you want better. I am sending better and greater your way. You have endured much in your life. People have walked away from you, judging you, but it only matters what I say you are. Stay on the path. I didn't create you to be perfect. I created you to be faithful. God is saying to you today, I have not forgotten you. I know where you are and I know how to get you to where you need to be. Even when things don't go the way you planned, my hand is on you. Do not be afraid. I am working behind the scenes on your behalf and I will lead you into a life of blessings, purpose, and favor. Trust me. God is shaking things up, moving things and people around in your life. He wants to deposit your blessings, but some situations and relationships must change. Not everyone can go with you on this next level of your journey. They're not equipped to support or encourage you. Some blessings bring out jealousy in people you'd never thought possible. On this level, you need only those who can handle seeing you prosper. Your season has come. 
Share your favorite Bible verse in the comments. God's not done with you yet. Your latter days shall be better than your former. Where you are now is only the beginning. God is about to launch you into the next dimension. Don't let your present circumstances discourage you because where you start will not be where you finish. The greatness that you've experienced on this level is only a small glimpse into the greatness to come. Get ready for your latter days. Keep moving forward. It will only get better. And though you started with little, you will end with much. Job 8, 7 God is saying to you today, I know you are going through a difficult time in your life right now and you are dealing with multiple circumstances and a lot of emotional pain. It seems as though before you can get through one thing, another thing happens. I don't always still the storm around you, sometimes I still the storm raging in you. Don't give up. I am strengthening you in areas that you cannot even see right now. You and I will get through this together, like we always do. Everything will be all right. Like this, if you believe in angels, God is saying to you today, I need you to really stay focused in the coming days. I am going to bless you soon with what you have been patiently waiting for, and the enemy knows this. The enemy is going to use people that you know to distract you with pettiness. Don't respond to that. Continue to quietly go about your day and be ready for the blessing. Your prayers are being answered quickly. The delay is over. You are about to head into a week of breakthroughs and blessings. Hash claim it. God is saying to you today, I'm turning your pain into power, your fears into focus, and your difficulties into determination. What the enemy intended for evil, I will use for good. Put your trust in me. I have a great plan for your life. God is saying to you today, the biggest breakthrough and blessing of your life is about to manifest. Everything you touch this week will prosper. You are stepping into your best days, I declare. Something you prayed about is moving closer to you. Get ready and start packing. God is about to put keys right in your hand. Something good is going to happen today. Healing is going to happen. Prayers are going to be answered. New opportunities and doors are going to open. Today will be big. In Jesus' name, amen. Your prayers are being answered quickly. The delay is over. This will be a week filled with blessings, healing, miracles, new opportunities, and breakthroughs. Share this to read God's love. God is saying to you today, don't worry, it's already worked out. You are reading this because God has spoken a blessing over you. He's saying, don't give up. Great things are on the way. God is saying to you today, the curse is broken and your finances shall begin to multiply. God will restore everything you lost. You will recover. You will bounce back. Better days are coming. Blessings are coming your way. An incredible door is opening for you. An opportunity of a lifetime is coming your way. God is going to give you favor and the resources you need to accomplish your dreams. God is saying to you today, you're not alone, ever. I am making a way for you right now. Answers are coming. The diagnosis from the doctor is never final. We serve a powerful God that heals today. 
comment faith if you trust in God's timing. God is going to replace your confusion with clarity and confirmation. He's going to give your mind rest and deliver you from anxiety and overthinking. I declare something you prayed about is moving closer to you. Get ready and start packing. God is about to put keys right in your hand. Something good is going to happen today. Healing is going to happen. Prayers are going to be answered. New opportunities and doors are going to open. Today will be big in Jesus' name. Amen. Your prayers are being answered quickly. The delay is over. This will be a week filled with blessings, healing, miracles, new opportunities, and breakthroughs. God is saying to you today, don't worry, it's already worked out. You are reading this because God has spoken a blessing over you. He's saying, don't give up. Great things are on the way. God is saying to you today, the curse is broken and your finances shall begin to multiply. An incredible door is opening for you. An opportunity of a lifetime is coming your way. God is going to give you favor and the resources you need to accomplish your dreams. Support our mission by donating today. God is saying to you today, you're not alone, ever. I am making a way for you right now. Answers are coming. The diagnosis from the doctor is never final. We serve a powerful God that heals today. God is going to replace your confusion with clarity and confirmation. He's going to give your mind rest and deliver you from anxiety and overthinking. God is saying to you today, blessings are coming your way. Angels are protecting you. The Holy Spirit is guiding you. Your finances will multiply. Your health will improve all your needs will be met. Your life will be filled with blessings and opportunities. I don't know who needs to hear this, but you're going to make it. This is your sign. You're going to make it and things will be restored better than before. Watch how God restores you. Watch how you make up for lost time. Jesus loves you and yes, you're going to make it. Share this testimony with your friends. There's a breakthrough headed your way and it is going to absolutely blow your mind. God has something amazing planned for you. God is saying to you today, your breakthrough is coming. You will soon receive the answers you have been asking and looking for. You will experience positive change in all areas of your life. You're not reading this by accident. This is your confirmation. You're going to make it, no matter what it looks like right now. God is sending blessings, solutions, healing, love, and positive change your way. So hold on. Be strong and don't give up. Welcome to your morning of miracles. I am declaring breakthroughs over your life today. You will see a harvest of blessings. Repeat after me, going into this day with a clear mindset, pure intentions, a prayer, and a plan. I know God is about to open doors that will take me higher mentally, spiritually, and financially. In Jesus' name, amen. Comment blessed if you feel God's presence. I declare the curse is broken. Your health will improve and your finances will begin to multiply. God is saying to you today, it's your winning season. No more losses, no more debts, and no more disappointments. I speak blessings over you and your family. This will be a productive week in Jesus' name. You will be safe, successful in your endeavors, and you will have great peace. The coming days will bring favor, breakthroughs, 
blessings, great victory, and joy. God is saying to you today, you are about to receive a blessing that will change your life forever. You are going to be notified that something wonderful has worked in your favor this week. Get ready is good. God is saying to you today, you haven't seen nothing yet. What I have in store for you this week is going to be bigger, better, and more rewarding than anything you've seen in the past. Like if you have faith in Jesus, don't you dare give up. The devil couldn't take you out last month and he's not going to take you out this month. You already have the victory. You are an overcomer. You are more than a conqueror. God is preparing you for greater, greater opportunities, greater health, greater peace of mind, greater blessings, greater finances. God is saying to you today, stay strong. I am your strength. I see what you're dealing with and I will bring you through it. Trust me in every storm. I have never left you before and I'm not leaving you now. Better days are up ahead. Don't give up. God is going to do something amazing in your life this month. I don't know what you've been praying about or what has had your pillows soaked with tears. But I am here today to tell you that God has heard your prayers. His angels have been dispatched and you will see your miracles soon. I declare you will see your health turn around for the good. You will surprise the doctors. You will get the job. Your job is to act and speak like it's going to happen. Walk by faith, not by sight. Type praise the Lord if you are grateful. God is saying to you today, you're entering a new season of consecutive wins. It's time. You've had enough lessons. You did the work. You overcame so much. You believed even when it was hard to. You never gave up. You pushed through it all. Now it's time for you to receive blessings in a major way. God is going to do something amazing in your life. I don't know what you've been praying about or what has had your pillows soaked with tears, but I am here today to tell you that God has heard your prayers. His angels have been dispatched and you will see your miracles soon. I declare you will see your health turn around for the good. You will surprise the doctors. You will get the job. Your job is to act and speak like it's going to happen. Walk by faith, not by sight. God is saying to you today, don't accept where you are as your final destination. I have greater for you. Where I had you start is never where I intended for you to finish. In order to get to the next level, you must be willing to undergo transformation. I have a great plan for you and your future. Jeremiah 29:11. Accepting what you aren't willing to change will keep you stuck. It's time to move forward. You don't want anything from your past to sabotage your future. Comment Amen if you trust in God's plan. God is saying to you tonight, every mountain and every stronghold that is delaying your progress and your dream is being removed right now your hope will be restored your expectations will be met and blessings and miracles will come into your life god is saying to you today i know you have been struggling for a long time financially spiritually and emotionally. You have a good heart and people have abused you in many ways. 
The devil has tried to make you lose your mind many times. You have been betrayed in many ways, yet you stand in the midst of your storms. You are still here because I am with you. I will not allow any weapon that is formed against you to prosper. Fear not. I am going to turn things around and bless you in the presence of your enemies. Hold on to your faith. God is saying to you today, I know you are secretly living in pain. You cry yourself to sleep every night not wanting to bother anyone. You don't know what else to do. Share this video if you believe in prayer. I know what is going on. I care and I see all things. I am already working on your behalf. Don't worry. I have you in the palm of my hand. You will come out of this better, brighter, and stronger than ever before. God is saying to you today, I know you are secretly living in pain. You cry yourself to sleep every night not wanting to bother anyone. You don't know what else to do. I know what is going on. I care and I see all things. I am already working on your behalf. Don't worry, I have you in the palm of my hand. You will come out of this better, brighter, and stronger than ever before. God is saying to you today, I know you are secretly living in pain. You cry yourself to sleep every night not wanting to bother anyone. You don't know what else to do. Like this post if you have been saved. I know what is going on. I care and I see all things. I am already working on your behalf. Don't worry. I have you in the palm of my hand. You will come out of this better, brighter, and stronger than ever before. God is saying to you today, I know you have a lot on your mind right now. It feels like the weight of the world is on your shoulders. You feel alone. Lay all your concerns before me in prayer. I will provide. I will make a way for you. Don't worry. I have your back. God is saying to you this afternoon, I am going to need you to pay close attention to things that are going on around you right now. The enemy is using people that you know to bring petty accusations and petty attacks against you. The purpose of these attacks are to distract you and cause you to lose focus on things that really matter in the kingdom. Let the pettiness go. Rise above it. Pray for these people and stay on the kingdom path. Comment, God is great if you feel his love. God heard your prayer last night. He felt the anxiety, the anguish, the confusion, and the pain. He seen the tears you shed for your parents, your children, your friends, your situation. God is saying to you today, For every teardrop, for every sleepless night, I have a blessing for you. You're coming out of this. I have sent a regiment of angels to clear the path for you. The pain you're feeling is coming to an end. Blessings, healing, miracles, solutions, and my divine favor is coming your way. Remember, my child, weeping may endure for a night, but joy come in the morning. Psalm 35. Share this to spread hope. God is turning your private prayers into public miracles. God is saying to you today, I am going to take every bit of anxiety, fear, stress, and pain away from you and fill you with my peace, love, healing, and blessings. God is saying to someone today, I won't leave you, no matter what people do. God wants you to know that his presence surrounds you today. You are not alone in this. This month, 
God is going to bring you endless blessings, bigger smiles, financial breakthroughs, and bigger opportunities. Subscribe if you believe in Jesus. God is saying to you today, you need to get ready. Where you are is not permanent. Blessings and breakthroughs are coming your way. I will increase you beyond your salary. I will bless you beyond your normal income. I will suddenly change things in your life. You got hit hard by the storm. You're about to get hit harder by blessings. God is saying to you today, turn your worry into worship. I got you. This month will be filled with good news, answered prayers, breakthroughs, miracles, and favor. God says, don't even think about giving up. You are going to make it no matter what it looks like right now. I know you're worried about your finances, your health, and your family. Remember, I always work in your favor. I will bless you today with peace, healing, and victory if you don't quit. I am going to bring something beautiful out of this ugly situation. Get ready for your blessings. The next three months are going to set you up for the next five years. God says, it's all coming together. Follow us for uplifting messages. Whatever your goals are for this week, I declare success is yours. Whatever battles you are fighting, I declare victory is yours. Whatever challenges you are facing, I declare you will overcome them. Your week will be positive, life-changing, and successful. In Jesus' name, Amen. When the Lord brings you through this, and He will bring you through this, you will never again return to the people that misused or mistreated you. You are not a doormat, and you are not just an option. You are a child of the King. Greater relationships, greater opportunities, and greater blessings are coming your way, says the Lord. God is saying to you today, Victory is coming to your household. Victory is coming in your finances. Victory is coming in your health. You are healthy and blessed. You are prosperous, successful, and loved. You are growing and you are winning. Expect good news today. Expect new opportunities today. Expect healing today. Comment faithful if you walk with God. Expect breakthroughs today. I declare God is making a way for you right now. God is going to shower you with blessings and new opportunities. Everything you've been praying for is coming. I declare your situation is about to take a turn for the better. Your health will be restored. Your finances will increase. You will have enough to pay your bills and be a blessing to someone else. Miracles and blessings are headed to your house. An unexpected blessing and opportunity is coming your way. God is going to do the impossible for you. Repeat after me, I am healed. I am blessed. I am strong and filled with God's Spirit. I am anointed. God's favor surrounds me. My family is protected and surrounded by angels. My home is filled with peace. The Lord is prospering me. This is my season. New doors are opening. Something good is about to find you. God is saying to you today, brighter days are on the horizon for you and your family. Your physical, financial, emotional, and professional dark days are coming to an end. Share your favorite hymn in the comments. There is a song in the heavens with your name on it. It is the song of your heart that cries out to me. Lord God, help me. I love you and I need you now more than ever. I hear your cries, the love song of your heart, and my heart is turned with compassion toward you. Let me soothe you with my tenderness toward you. 
Receive my grace and mercy, the glimpses of joy that spark in your heart even amidst the storm. Hold on to the little tender mercies I send your way, for they shall give you the strength you need to make it through each day. My love surrounds you. My compassion carries you through the most difficult days. Be encouraged, for I am about to do a new thing in your life, something unexpected. The tides do change, and so do life circumstances. From deep within your heart, I will raise up a new, vibrant, and healthy crop of righteousness. The great harvest is at hand, so prepare yourself this hour and follow after me. Like if you believe in the power of prayer, some days you will run into situations that will cause you to stumble. Do not look back. Keep pressing forward. And if you do look back, ask me to help you. Look upon that situation through my eyes and I will show you different ways to handle similar circumstances. I want to be your very best friend. I am the most faithful friend you will ever know and I always stick to my promises. I always have and I always will. I promise to love you always that will never change. Be confident and trust in me always. I am with you now. Sometimes you are faced with adversity and trials that seem too difficult to bear. I understand the trial you are going through. I am here to help you weather this storm. No matter how hard the wind is blowing or how turbulent the waters are rushing about you, I am with you holding you tighter than you can imagine and I will never let you go. Please do not let go of me. Hope against all hope and I will make a way for you and your family. I have each one of you in the palm of my hand. I want you to know that whenever the task before you seems too daunting, it is before you for a reason. I want to show you how strong you have become. You may think you are weak, but you are indeed strong, for I am within you and I am strong. I am all the strength you need. Share this blessing with others. Have hope, my child. Have hope. Trust in me and I will continue to keep that hope alive within you. That hope will give you the strength and courage to face the storm and walk through it with confidence. I am taking you by the hand this day and leading you to walk beside still waters. In the midst of your circumstances, remember to be thankful, and that will help you to change your mindset and help keep you on the right course. Believe and hope. I am with you to satisfy the longings of your heart. Be patient, for they are coming just in time. Each time you persevere through difficult times, you are one step closer to your victory through me. If you feel beat up on today from those who have hurt you or crushed your spirit with unkind words or acts, just come to me and I will speak words of life to you that will lift you up and give you new strength for your day. Know this. I am with you. I am for you. I love you. That, my child, will never change. Go forth now into your day with a new spring in your step and joy in your heart just by knowing and believing in your heart that I am with you. My peace I give to you now. Rest in me. Share this blessing with others. This may be a difficult day for you. Call out to me. I have much to share with you that will help you to be successful on your journey. Even when the path before you is filled with thorns and you do not know how to proceed, I will make the way for you. 
You do not have to figure everything out this moment. My wisdom will pour over you as you are ready to receive the truth of my word. Do not be sad, my child. Comment saved if you have been redeemed. Type amen if you agree. Like this video if you believe in God. Subscribe this channel for more videos.